We got Fred Joe Star back in the building on Black TV. What's good? How you I'm blessed. Every day above ground is a blessing. You know that. I love, that's my favorite saying. Straight up, the sun is shining. I always say that. The sun is out. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting calls from niggas in jail. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So, it, 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 you know what I'm saying? It's not that bad. Right. You know what I mean? Shout out to my nigga Ike. Ike from Brooklyn. Love it. Yeah. Love the shades. Love the chain. You know, summertime flow. <laughs> we back on the roll. Onyx is doing festivals. Mm. Holla at us. You know what I'm saying? Holla at my man Perry. OnyxHQ.com. You know what I'm saying? We got the illest show on earth. Straight up. Man, I know you were recently booked for Rock the Bells. Rock the Bells. Yo, I have Yo, such... salute to Rock the Bells. Love. I, I can't believe they went away. Nah, but see, I think it was something different. Like Rock the Bells now, when you when you say Rock the Bells, because we all know Rock the Bells is from L Cool J. You know what I'm saying? That's his whole, that's his whole thing. You know what I'm saying? And I think when they was doing Rock the Bells shows back in the days, I don't think he had anything to do with it. I might be wrong. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? But now he controls the Rock the Bells. He got the radio popping, you know what I'm saying? Salute the Rock the Bells. That's all I listen to, Shay on, on, on Sirius. Rock the Bells and Shape 45. That's it. But um yeah, man, it's good to be performing in Queens. You know what right. I mean? Right. Onyx ain't, you know, we from Southside Jamaica, Queens, right? I was gonna say that. So cool. when they announced the show, we wasn't announced. You know what I'm saying? I felt a certain way. I was like, yo, how you doing a show in Queens and y'all ain't got y'all ain't got the Queens, you know what I'm saying? Kings in the, on the joint. You know what I'm saying? You got to have Onyx on there. So I had to call some people, you know what I mean? And um, yeah, we're going to be rocking. It's going to be Onyx. I think Havoc from Mob Deep. Um, rest in peace to Prodigy. And um, I think um, Lost Professor. We're going to be on the same set representing Queens. So yeah, man, it's going to be dope. First of all, how easy or difficult was it for you to call some people and get you on the bill like that? I'm just saying. <laughs> Ice Cube, my brother, right? Okay. LL, my brother, right? Right. Now, nah, really, those are my brothers. Like, people, my, I like Ice Cube. I played his brother in a movie called Torque. I played his little brother. You know what I'm saying? The high head while and I got killed and all that. I played LL's brother on In the House. So those are my brothers, my TV brothers. But those are my real brothers, too. And um, they said, yo, we got to get Onyx on there for sure. Facts. What are you most excited for? Because that bill is crazy, and I just feel like that festival is hip hop in a nutshell. Like, fuck the Rolling Louds. It's about rock the bells. Yo, there's nothing ever like this. Not this is the first time in Queens. I think something like this has, you know, been so. You know, what I'm saying crazy. Like Ice Cube is gonna be in Queens. Like not like Manhattan. You know, most people go to Manhattan or they go to Jersey. They in Queens. That's crazy. So yeah, I think this is definitely for the culture. Definitely gonna be one of the biggest, dopest shows. They mixing it up, a lot of artists. You got Rick Ross coming through too, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like it's a lot of different different artists gonna be on the bill too. You know what I'm saying? Shout to everybody that's gonna be performing. There's so many people, I can't even, man, it's crazy. <laughs> right, I mean Lil' Kim, Busta Rhymes, Fat Joe, Remy Ma. Oh, I can't wait to see Busta Rhymes. Oh, what's the last Nori, time? Nori performing too, right? Uh, is he? Yeah, I think Marby performing too. It's going to be crazy. That's crazy. It's going to be crazy. You were reminiscing on some times with LL Cool J on Moesha? Well, you know, yeah, LL, you know, we was, when I was doing Moesha, we was at the Paramount lot mm. and he was doing In the House. Mm. So we used to always see each other, you know what I'm saying? Go snatch up a little lunch here and there, you know what I'm saying? Rock and roll clams and all that, you know what I'm saying? And, um, that's just like my big bro. You know what I'm saying? Put me on a lot of game in Hollywood. And um, so the Moesha thing was going in a different um, direction. They was like, they called me in for the meeting. They was like, yo, your character's doing well on the show, but we want to go on a wider audience. I was like, wider audience? <laughs> <laughs> wider? Why, why like, wider? What are you trying to say? You know what I'm so, yeah. But anyway, even though... I got off the show, they still had to pay me for the whole year. Okay. So I was chilling. I wasn't, you know what I mean? I'm like, all right, y'all still got to pay me for another eight episodes. I'm just chilling, you know, sipping daiquiris. I'm chilling. So LL was like, yo, come on my show. I'm like, yeah, right. So we was we was eating, word is one, we was eating rock and roll clams. 
You know what I'm saying? At the Thai spot we used to go to. And um, and and he was like, yo, I told him about it. He was like, yo, after we eat, we're gonna go to we gonna go to the set and I'm gonna introduce you to the producers. So after we ate, we went to the set, his set, walked on, met the producers. He was like, yo, he's gonna be my little brother on his on on, on his team. Write him in. They was like, oh yeah, we know Fresh. All right, cool. Next thing I know, I got the broom. You know, sweeping the broom. Yo, yo, man, yo, 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 Trey, man. Grandma, I've been waiting for you. Where you been at? I'm on the show. A couple of episodes. Right. So L was always, you know, always a good brother. That's beautiful. Yeah. I was going to say, how's that acting check compared to rapping? I mean, you know, rapping, it's nothing like rapping, though. Nothing like rap. Nothing like going on stage, performing for 20,000 people, signing autographs, people with... Onyx tattoos. Right. Like, that's different. You know, because now you're making a difference. Right. I mean, yeah, movies, you making a difference too because people, you know, I got a lot of people say, I named my son after you, Malachi. Like, like some people Beautiful. are affected by it and they feel that. But hip-hop is 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 the foundation. You know what oh, I'm saying? Yeah. Like, when we came in the game with Jam Master J, you know what I'm saying? We already from that cloth, the Run DMC cloth. So to rock with LL... Is just part of the family. We was already on Def Jam with L back in the day. So, you know, it's going to be crazy. That is. Man, 